Eight Salvation Army volunteers from across the United States are currently competing for the world bell ringing record. Contestants must brave the elements and fight fatigue for more than 60 hours in order to claim the title. All money raised will stay within the local community and fund life-changing social service programs. For updates from the contest, visit our national blog, Facebook page, or follow the event on Twitter using hashtag RingItOn. Following the 2010 earthquake, the Salvation Army of Haiti identified four direct service priorities for residents struggling to rebuild. Permanent housing, livelihood support, agriculture, and vocational training. This week, thanks to the financial support of Salvation Army donors from around the world, 108 young adults from Port-au-Prince will enter the area's premier vocational training program. The students will learn about home construction, electricity, plumbing, ceramics, and auto mechanics. This training will give these students the hard skills needed to attain employment and rebuild their lives. On December 8th, the Salvation Army lost one of its finest leaders. General John Gowans was promoted to glory from South London at the age of 78. General Gowans, known for his passionate service and stirring sermons, served as the Salvation Army's international leader from 1999 until 2002. The general entered the International Training College in 1954 as a cadet of the Sole Survivor Session. From there, he and his wife Giselle served in the United Kingdom, France, Australia, and the United States. Has the Salvation Army got one leg longer than the other? Is it topsy-turvy? Are we giving too much attention to social service and not enough attention to spirituality and soul winning? God save us if we are, but all three are necessary to be a well-balanced Salvation Army. The funeral and Thanksgiving service for the life and ministry of General Gowans will be held in the Assembly Hall of the William Booth College in London on Friday, December 14th at 12.30 p.m. The committal service will follow at Hither Green Crematorium at 2.30 p.m. In closing, we turn to John. These things I have spoken to you, that in me you may have peace. In the world you have tribulation, but be of good cheer. I have overcome the world. Be sure to tune in next week for more Salvation Army news from around the world. For Salvation Army Today, I'm Roberta Simmons-Smith. Good day and may God bless you.